nice and rosy, sun-kissed looking. I got stung by a jellyfish. I'm gonna watch this clip back and it's gonna look like not blended in. Everything is just vibes. I am gonna head off to work now. Hi guys, I am back from holiday. So I thought I'd do a little get ready with me as I am heading back from, um, heading back to work today. Um, I've caught a little bit of the sun, as you can see, I'm quite red here. Um, anywho, so I'm just gonna start off with using the Pisbeon Allergy Sun Sensitive Lotion in SPF 50, my favorite. Um, I have caught a bit of the sun on my face as well. So I think I'm just gonna leave my skin as is today and not add any skin tint to it. So we spent four days in Malta. Um, we had quite a good time, spent it exploring quite a bit. And do you know what? We spent most of our time on public transport as well. Um, public transport over there is quite easy, um, like the buses are quite easy um, to use but um, they're not always going to get you, like if they're packed right, like full to the brim, they'll literally like skip past you and some of the drivers you can see like are sorry but um, yeah like they get packed so much because you've got both the locals and the tourists on the buses as well so you can't get both and um, my friend and I literally stood waiting for a bus for an hour and a half and uh, they all just skipped past so in the end we had to get an Uber uh, they're relatively cheap over there for Ubers but still yeah and then next up I'm gonna get my Ultra Sun um, SPF 50 lip protection gonna <laughs> place that under my eye and on my eyelids as well and then on my lips I feel like my lips are quite burnt I kept on reapplying re and reapplying this if you do like this video please like and subscribe if you want to see more from me and also I did have my hair done yesterday as well so it's a lot blonder I wanted it to be a bit more dramatic um, since we are heading into summer now and the UK is a little bit warmer than it was, um, which is great. Um, I'm gonna let this sit on my face for a little bit um, and maybe do a bit more unpacking. Literally got home last night absolutely exhausted because um, I headed from London to Bath to get my hair done and then headed home as well. So I'm very tired and yeah. I have not been well um, during our trip I have not been well and I'm still not like 100% today at all um, I was throwing up um, I get travel sickness but mixed with like I have a very very sensitive stomach so mix that with having a sensitive stomach as well I threw up on the bus and I threw up on the at the bus stop and I threw up back in the hotel and then um, ever since then I've just had really really bad acid reflux and heartburn it's just been so so bad like honestly like uh, so uncomfortable all throughout yesterday I just I just couldn't like nothing would settle my stomach and I've just been in pain a lot every time I've eaten as well I just can't digest the food um, yeah, I've just not been well, guys. Right, so we've got to keep ourselves hydrated. Do you ever find that, like, on holiday, you just don't drink as much water as you do at home? I feel like I drink so much water at home, but when it comes to, like, drinking water abroad or anything, I just have, like, little sips. It's not even like I'm thirsty, um, even though I know I should be drinking because it's hot weather. Um, so... I'm gonna go in with the Primark concealer stick in the shade Chestnut. As I am not using the skin tint, this has to be blended in very thoroughly. Um, 
every day I would just literally like fall asleep as soon as we got back had showers and stuff I would just literally as my friend would say conk out I'd literally like fall asleep so our first day we arrived um, a little bit later than anticipated um, but we got there, settled down for a bit. My friend, her luggage was literally locked. Like she had it, she put in her um, passcode and everything on the luggage, but it wouldn't open. Um, so we had to open it somehow. Uh, and then um, we went to Valletta on the first day, which was really nice. It had like a combination of like, old buildings and like modern shops there um and then we just visited like some of like the like doing like the sightseeing basically we saw like the gardens and like cathedral like things like that um it was really cool and uh, we got the bus literally like on the get-go to Valletta and I didn't, obviously it was like shock to my sister and like it was like 30, 40 minute bus ride and like just holding onto the handles like the whole time which is like crazy. For me, if I can walk everywhere then I would um, or if I could teleport then I would because that would just make life so much easier. I feel like I'm quite red in my cheeks as well. So that is that all blended in. I'm gonna watch this clip back and it's gonna look like not blended in. But there, there we are. And then I'm gonna take this Rare Beauty blush in the shade Nearly Rose. It's quite a dewy blush. Here it is in all its glory. So I'm gonna take that and put it on my cheeks using my fingers. Take a bit first. It's not as like pigmented um, as I thought it would be but it just melts into the skin really really well so you can build it up if you want to but it looks quite dewy on the skin which is really nice so I'm just going to blend it on um, the high points of my cheeks up into my temples just to give me a bit more rosiness and so and also I might blend it up into like my nose as well. Right, as you can see, the blush kind of matches my sunburn. Um, and so it works really well for my skin tone. Um, so I'm gonna blush on the other side of my, my other cheek as well. I don't know what I'm talking about, am I okay? Right, so as you can see, this blush matches like the colour I go when um, I get a bit rosy and the sun or sunburn. Um, so, so I'll just take a bit of this blush and kind of like place it like on my nose as well. So the cruise is where I caught most of the sun because the sun was literally, we were on the sun deck. So being on the sun deck meant that obviously we got a lot of the sun. Anyway, so I'm going to add this on my forehead. And so the cruise took us through the um, island. So it went past Camino and then it went to the Blue Lagoon, which is absolutely beautiful. I got stung by a jellyfish in the um, water there. Oh, it was literally so beautiful there. And we went on a speedboat as well. It was so good because we wanted to see like the caves and also the crystal lagoon as well. And then it dropped us to Gozo um, where we could spend an hour there, um, an hour and a half there actually, and um, explore the city as well. Um, yeah, it was incredible um, to see everything within seven hours and um, yeah, it was such a good time, but I was not well at all. Um, we went to this uh, pastizzi um, bit and um, I got a pizza thing 
um, after that I was not feeling well. My stomach was very unsettled and it was doing the most and um, I was sat on the toilet and um, my friend was literally saying, Kaz, we've got three minutes to get to the bus. I felt like in Monte Carlo, you know when they're like on the Eiffel Tower and the tour bus is leaving them, I, I literally, we legged it, we legged it to the bus and um, we got there literally just on time. But there were a few people that got on that bus that didn't originally pay for that bus. And so we were literally like standing and like looking at all the seats, everything was full and um, the driver kicked off a few people too. Yeah, we paid for those seats, so. Anyway, so that is my complexion done. Nice and rosy, sun-kissed looking. There we go. Um, very healthy, very dewy looking. I'm gonna go off and do my eyebrows using the Anastasia Dip Brow, or what I have left of it. And I'll also do my eyelashes off camera as well using the Kiss mascara right and say the makeup is done eyelashes are on so I use peaches and cream lashes in number eight the tray for you number eight those are the lashes just sit so nicely and then should I do a hair reveal do you want to see my hair literally had to squeeze in this appointment um, So this is how he styled it for me yesterday. It was a lot tighter yesterday. Obviously I've slept now. So much more blonde through my hair. Um, I should give it a little bit of a brush though. Uh, yeah, but all together, this is how I do my makeup after holiday, getting a bit of a tan. Yeah. Right guys, so here is the hair and makeup all together. Got my summer clothes on, got my summer tan, and got my summer hair, summer makeup. Everything is just vibes. I am gonna head off to work now, and I'll see you guys in the next video. I hope you liked catching up with me, hearing about my trip to Malta, um, and I hope you have a beautiful summer ahead of you.